Prince Harry and Prince William's relationship has yet to fully recover from the Duke of Sussex's Mexit scandal and explosive memoirs fair. As the Prince of Wales gets closer to ascending the throne, experts believe the future king doesn't envision his brother participating in his monarchy. When William becomes king, I always believed Harry would be one of his top advisors, Charles Ray told an outlet. I think that's out of the window. That's what Diana always wanted, the boys to remain as close as possible, they had each other, and it was them against the rest of the world, but of course now it's not happening," he added. OK previously reported royal commentator Tom Quinn predicted the Duke of Sussex was disappointed to see William get closer to Queen Camilla as King Charles battles cancer. He really distrusts that William actually gets on rather well now with Camilla, Harry will see this as a betrayal, Quinn told an outlet. He was shocked when William realized that Camilla, far from being the monster they thought her when they were children, is actually a rather nice woman, the royal author added. She is exceptionally good at listening with a sympathetic ear and William has definitely warmed to that. Prior to Charles' diagnosis, Katie Nichol discussed the prince's fractured bond in an interview. My royal sources say that any chance of a reconciliation really isn't ruled out, but it's certainly not going to happen anytime soon, she explained. Prince William is still incredibly upset with Harry's autobiography, which, of course, really cast William in a pretty bad light. No one's going to forget anytime soon the stories of them coming to physical blows and William allegedly shoving Prince Harry, forcing him onto the ground where he landed onto a dog bowl, the biographer added. In spare, Harry painted William as ill-tempered. I'm told by several sources close to the Prince of Wales that William really just cannot find it in his heart at the moment to forgive his brother for what he's done, Nicol shared. I think Kate, Princess of Wales, she's always always had a very close relationship with Prince Harry, but she's been left quite devastated by some of the anecdotes that Harry told in spare that didn't cast her a particularly good light. I think there's a great sense of betrayal, she added. At the time of Nichols' interview, Harry was set to attend the Wealth Child Awards in the UK, but he failed to reunite with William during his short visit. Any chance the brothers seeing each other, I'm told, is simply not on the cards, the journalist revealed. The King is still in residence at Balmoral. That's where he will stay over the coming days. Apparently, there is no time in his schedule for him to see Harry, Nichols said. There are no plans that we are aware of for Harry to visit the King, and we're told the King's diary is pretty busy at the moment, too. Ray spoke to the Sun.